Okay, what we've done here, we've uh, constructed the inner side uh, structure of the uh, rear quarter panels. Uh, we've used a lot of boxing techniques to get a lot of strength in this area. We've made new wheel, inner wheel arches. Uh, we've lengthened the sill panel right through. Inside we've made up uh, huge channel sections which uh, give a tremendous amount of strength to the floor. Tremendous amount of strength uh, in behind the uh, driver's cockpit area. We fabricated uh, inner strut housings, which will eventually be covered by the wheel housings, so you won't see any large ugly protrusions uh, as per original. We'll just have a small billet plug which will go in the top of the strut tower area. But basically, the wheel arches will be a nice round contoured fit. We've done uh, RHS tubing uh, floor supporting frame. The sheet metal floor will sit upon this. In these uh, pocketed areas, uh, just above the fuel tank, which is this front section, we will have a hinged uh, door system. Uh, all the computer equipment, uh, stereo equipment, uh, satellite navigation equipment will all be housed in this area in a special tray. At the rear will be the same sort of setup. We'll have a, a hinge door system. Uh, we'll retain the original plastic drop tray which holds the battery and uh, a few electrical items and the, um, the spare tyre uh, kit.